Hi, happy Mother's Day. There's some irony in, in my choice of t-shirts today uh, on this particular Mother's Day in that it does represent my support for women to have the right to make a choice about their own health, about their own bodies, about whether or not they choose at any given particular time to take a pregnancy to term. But I, I chose this t-shirt today very specifically in honor of one such woman who did make that choice. She left Texas to go to Colorado to have an abortion. She had to leave Texas to do this because of the onerous draconian anti-abortion legislation that's been passed in Texas over the last several years. And upon her return, she was brutally murdered. She thought that she was taking control of her life and in fact, she ended up losing it violently and unnecessarily. Her name is Gabriela Gonzalez and I wear this t-shirt in her memory. Now this incident also draws attention not only to the anti-abortion laws in Texas, but to the easy availability of firearms. Gabriella's boyfriend and the man who impregnated her welcomed her home by first trying to strangle her and when she escaped, he pulled out a firearm and shot her in the head. And then after she dropped to the ground, he fired several more times into her prone body and then ran away. This is a perfect example of toxic masculinity at work. It's also a perfect example of how in this country, in the United States of America, People no longer choose to settle their differences through civil conversation, through dialogue, using words. Instead, if somebody is fearful or, or feel that they've been offend, uh, offended in some way, they take out a gun and shoot the person. This has to end. I don't know what to say to the family of Gabriella, except that I mourn for her death, that it was needless, unnecessary, and that the person who did this should be brought to justice. But in the meantime, please, we need to stand up for women's rights to control their own bodies, to control their own health, to control their own destiny, and to choose when and under what circumstances they become mothers. Once again, happy Mother's Day.